So what I want to show today is a mobile X term, which is a tool that we use for um, logging into uh, our Linux hosts primarily. Um, so you can just go to the mobile X term homepage, download the home editions, free version of it here, um, and go ahead and install it. You can see I have it installed here. Uh, whenever you do a uh, shift right click, it brings up this context menu. You notice on that previous one, it didn't show run as, as different user. That's what we're looking for. Um, is whenever you do shift right click, you're looking for that run as different user. If you don't get that, go run this program MMC, which is the Microsoft Management Console. Uh, you can bring this up, add a snap in. Um, for the global user configuration, um, go through and after you OK that, you're going to look for the smart card configuration. There's an allow username hint. Uh, edit that. You should be able to enable or disable um, that username hint box. Um, in my case, it came up enabled. It doesn't show up on this um, on the icon on my desktop, but the one down in my start menu, you see run as different user. So shift right click. You always got to remember that. And that will bring up this smart card. Uh, enter your PIN number for your smart card, and then that you, you run as different user. That's what gives you this username hint box in the bottom. The username hint box are, are we use our NDC domain name, which you saw, and it's a has that AA prefix to it. That AA is administrative access, um, so that's not your normal NDC user. You have to add that to uh, be able to log into the Linux boxes. And now then we're going to start, um, we're going to change some settings on here to uh, enable our smart card to work. Um, there's, go to the settings, SSH, and enable Cabreros. Um, whenever you do that, you'll see the uh, domain name pop up. Um, that's what we expect, ndc.nasa.gov. And next we're going to create a new session. Um, this time, so we're going to do an SSH session to uh, Sprite Dev 5. Uh, we'll just put in the host name. I'm going to click specify username. I'm going to accept the default. So by logging in with that username hint, it took my default uh, username uh, AAD heater. Uh, the smart card logged me in automatically to this machine. And so I, I have no password. Um, it just knows to log me in using my smart card and my credentials there. Uh, thanks for watching.